Hey, it's Christmas Eve! Merry Christmas! So, how many of Santa's helpers do we have playing today? Thank you! Playing alone, huh? You should be the smartest player in the game. Why don't you give me your name? 25 seconds. Alright, pick your icon. Just hit the number. 30 seconds. Okay, your buzzer's gonna be the letter B. Okie doke, let's go! Wow, look at you, playing Head Rush by yourself. Hey, can I let you in on a little secret? You're gonna win. Now then. So, alright, let's do it! Category, please. Say hello to high kicks in low places. $10,000 for this one. Hey, remember that really cool video game that they made into a lousy movie, Double Dragon? If instead of the Double Dragon, the evil Koga were trying to get a double helix from the Lee brothers, what would he be trying to steal? A DNA molecule, a musical instrument, a cat with a bag of tricks, or a space satellite? A double helix is the term used to describe the structure of a DNA molecule. I guess Koga's just trying to figure out how to make Lee jeans. Ha <laughs> ha DNA? Jeans? Lee? Okay, never mind. Okay, pick a category. And this is, if you see one, squash it. Get it right, I'm handing over 20K. All right, now get ready to fill in the blank. A full-grown Smurf stands three blank high. It's a full-grown Smurf measures three apples. Three sweet apples. Three sickeningly sweet apples. Three apples that are so sweet you'll practically choke on them and die, okay? I need a category. This one's called Big Magicians with Little Dickens. You get this one right, it's worth 30,000 greenbacks. Hey, you know that creepy magician guy, David Copperfield? Say David Copperfield works in the place that Charles Dickens' David Copperfield worked as a child. If he performs magic on this place in his next TV special, what might you see? A carnival float, a factory disappear, a mine shaft explode, or a skyscraper shrink? Charles Dickens' book, David Copperfield, revealed the horrible conditions many children were forced to work under in factories during the 1800s. I can't imagine oppressing people like that. Hey, old man, get off your butt and get back to work. Oh, right away, me lord. All righty, pick one. Well, now, what do we have here? Hey, you just picked a dis or dad. The category for this dis or dat question is art, farts, and sweet rides. Okay, I'm gonna read off seven names, and for each one, I want you to tell me if it's a famous artist or a foreign car. Okay, fine, you know the rules. Here comes the monkey timer. Let's boogie. Audi, famous artist or foreign car? Cezanne. Van Gogh. Fiat. El Greco, Vermeer, last one, Alfa Romeo, that's all she wrote, you rock, you rock, you rock, let's check out your score, yeah, that's gotta feel good, don't it, alright, let's move on, okay, I need a category, Alright, give it up for a giant leap for frozen vegetables. 20,000 bucks says you don't know this one. Eh, okay, you've seen that uh, green giant guy in the frozen food section of the store? You know, the big broccoli looking guy who goes ho ho ho? If green giant were to change their spokesperson to red giant, what would be their new catchphrase? Is it crack crack crack, beep beep beep, moo moo moo, or glow glow glow? A red giant is a type of really old star, so instead of saying ho ho ho, he'd just sit there and glow. Here, Billy, here's your red giant frozen dinner. Now be careful, it's hot. Thanks, Mom. Yeah! Category, please. <laughs> the 
The category? What kind of name is Jemima? And it's worth 20000 bucks if you get this one right. And we're off. Say that instead of buying some Aunt Jemima waffles, you mistakenly buy a box of Aunt Jemima's offals. What will you be eating for breakfast? Aunt Jemima's delicious pancake recipes, Aunt Jemima's partially digested supper, Aunt Jemima's inedible innards, or... When an animal is slaughtered, the parts that aren't used are called the offal. Tastes awful. Okay, pick... It's headbutt time! One headbutt category coming up. Is that what punk rockers wear? This question's gonna start out at 50,000 big ones. Here's how to work the headbutt. You're gonna see an equation like this one. Oh, fabulous. Can we go now? Volleyball move plus brand of G. Talk to me. Type in your answer and hit. Yep, Spike Lee. Great filmmaker. Better Knicks fan. I need a category. For your enjoyment, I'd like to pound them. 10,000 beanies if you get this one. Flex those fingers, because here it comes. What do you get if you run over a pound of pound puppies? 10 ounces of scrambled puppies, 12 ounces of mashed puppies, 16 ounces of squished puppies, or 32 ounces of... A pound is equal to 16 ounces. Now what happens if you put a pound of Beanie Babies in a blender? Alrighty, pick one. Looks like this category is... Toothpaste is for wimps. 20,000 bucks for a correct answer. Here's the pitch. Oh no, you haven't been brushing your teeth and now you need dentures. If you have to pay for your dentures by becoming an indentured servant, what will you have to do? In colonial times, indentured servants had to work as slaves for a fixed period of time in exchange for their passage to America. Okay now boy, get in there and clean that spit sink. Oh. With your tongue. Okay, okay. Okay, I need a category. Now serving, playing doctor with Howard Stern's private parts. This one will get you 10 grand. Heads up, here it comes. If Howard Stern changes his name to Howard Sternum, where will you most likely... The sternum is the bone at the center of your chest, otherwise known as the breastbone. So I guess the argument would be over. I mean, there'd be no doubt that Howard Stern is a total boob. Category, please. Don't move, because we'll be right back after this short commercial message. You got fever and chills and a running nose. My Larry Dow. He's been bitten by disease carrying mosquitoes. My Larry Dow. I just give him a squeeze and spread tropical disease. My Larry Dow. A little jumpy, aren't we? What, is that sweat I see dripping off your brow? Relax and take a look at this clue. I feel so incomplete without you. And it's true, I do. But uh, let's not get mushy. Good luck.
game. Green, green, green. What can I say? Good job. And uh, get a social life, you know. Throw a party or something, you know. Write some letters. Hey, thanks for head rushing with me. I gotta go. Nice job, people. Baby Diva, it's in your hands. Tell me, we doing another one right away? Wow, you made it all the way to the high scoreboard by pushing some poor slob out of there. Just let me know when you're ready to go again, meanie. You can do the beatbox. Is that the part that goes like... Something like that.